Today, every inhabitant of this planet must contemplate the day when this planet may no longer be habitable. Every man, woman, and child lives under a nuclear sword of Damocles, hanging by the slenderest of threads, capable of being cut at any moment by accident or miscalculation or by madness. The weapons of war must be abolished before they abolish us. We all know the atomic bomb is very dangerous. Since it may be used against us, we must get ready for it, just as we are ready for many other dangers that are around us all the time. You have to know what happens when an atomic bomb explodes. You will know when it comes. We hope it never comes, but we must get ready. There is a bright flash, brighter than the sun, brighter than anything you've ever seen. You are not ready, did not know what to do, it could hurt you in different ways. It could knock you down hard, or throw you against a tree or a wall. It is such a big explosion, it can smash in buildings and knock signboards over and break windows all over town. But if you duck and cover like Bert, you will be much safer. than a terrible sunburn, especially where you're not covered. The teacher is explaining that there are two kinds of attack, with warning and without any warning. We think that most of the time we will be warned before the bomb explodes, so there will be time for us to get into our homes, schools, or some other safe place. You may be in your schoolyard playing when the signal comes. That signal means to stop whatever you are doing and get to the nearest safe place fast. Always remember, the flash of an atomic bomb can come at any time, no matter where you may be. You might be out playing at home when the warning comes. Then be sure to get into the house fast, for your parents have fixed a safe place for you to go. This government, as promised, has maintained the closest surveillance of the Soviet military buildup on the island of Cuba. Within the past week, unmistakable evidence has established the fact that a series of offensive missile sites is now in preparation on that imprisoned island. The purpose of these bases can be none other than to provide a nuclear strike capability against the Western Hemisphere. 